$250,000 reward was offered for his arrest. Sean Laval Smith, the suspect in the stabbing death of Rihanna Cooper. Callum Farquhar, Rakeem Leandri, and Jordan Parker were found guilty of murdering Christopher Albury Burridge. Smell that fresh country air. This is all your fault. Hey, Dad. Look what I found. What is it? It's a videotape. Hello, we're the Kellys. A warning. That is not just a mountain. In the olden days, it was home to the mischievous fairies of yore. Our book is real. What? What is he talking about? You can drop the act, Kevin. Why does no one in this family ever believe me? Semi Lee Williams facing this first degree murder charge for the stabbing death of 14 year old Ryan Rogers. Rudy Gouede, murder of British student Meredith Kircher. Joel Osei, who's 26 years old, killed a 43 year old Irishman, Adrian Murphy. 21 years old Aloisi Dada admitted stabbing the 17 year old Katrina Makanova to death. Zephaniah McLeod admits killing uni worker Jacob Billington, aged 23. Ali Harbi Ali is arrest at the scene of the murder of MP Sir David Amos. Colin Ferguson fired off 30 shots into a crowded Long Island bound train, killing six people and leaving 19 injured. Garika Gordon was arrested on suspicion of murder. The body was identified as Phoenix Nets. Michael Adebalajo and Michael Adebawale, they ran over Fusilier Lee Rigby, armed with knives and a meat cleaver. Adebalajo tried to behead him. Adebawale hacked at his body. Svensson Onga Kui were found guilty of Jodie's murder. Just a few months before she died, Jodie had visited 10 Downing Street with her scout group. 23-year-old Femi Nandap, who had a history of mental health problems and was known to police. Nandap has pleaded guilty to manslaughter on the grounds of diminished responsibility. But Dr Ensink's baby daughter will never know her father and may one day ask who was responsible for his death. Six men were found guilty of the murder of Mary Ann Lennon. They were also convicted of kidnap, false imprisonment and rape.